Okay, we're going on to the next part, the KMP. So, the KMP, so we're gonna have it here. We're gonna replace the toad circuit KCL with this one, this KCL, and then we're gonna export the KMP for toad circuit in here. And then, so what we need to do, we need to export this and then make it a KMP object for positioning. Nope, wait, this is the wrong program. <laughs> this is Mercury Campy. Uh, open a f Here, okay. Okay, we got it here. So, we gotta deselect everything for right now, except the checkpoints, I'll re-enable that in a second. A and the objects as well. Tools, open OBJ manager. Um, here, KMP, and bam, we have the model. So what we need to do is we need to make the checkpoints. Hold on, actually, I'll just. So we need to make a new group. Um, previous, so we need zero, and zero, and then uh, I think it's this. No, it's the opposite. So this is how you make the checkpoints. Marker seven checkpoints are like really tight, so I have to do this right here. Make sure they're not combining, by the way, unless you want to, if you're having an upper section, just do clip ID and change it to something that's not the original checkpoints. And, okay, so, now we gotta add key checkpoints, so right here, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's what I'm gonna do, at least. And now we're gonna um, add a respawn point right here at the right here 180 objects. Let's delete the objects really quickly. Besides this, so we'll keep a few objects, and that's it. I'm gonna keep the toad circuit glider. I'm gonna remove the. Those cooling handlers, the pipes. Yeah, actually, we yeah we don't need pipes right now currently. So I'll keep the sun, the star grid, the skybox, and delete the trees and the uh, start grid. So I'm gonna put the start grid right here. The okay. Toad circuit glider. Right here. Negative ninety. Actually no, it is ninety. Never mind. I just remember it pointed this way. Does it hold on? Yeah, it does. Okay. So now we got the objects in there. We're gonna save the KMP and then we're gonna replace it for testing. And we're gonna delete the old objects that we don't need, like the toad circuit balloons. The pylon, I think that's the uh, the cone. We're gonna not delete that. We're gonna keep the I uh, no no delete the tree and then delete the. We're gonna actually use this later, so we're gonna keep that. Save. And we're gonna replace the course. And then we're gonna load the game. So let's see. 
We're gonna load the game and then we're gonna. S which I I stole my boyfriend. Why is it not loading? Okay, or I stole my boyfriend mod from uh, the last mod showcase. So we're gonna play that, I guess. So this is just for testing. So. Okay, let's test the track out. Uh. Hold on. So it is wrong, it's positioned wrong for the checkpoints then. That means, so I gotta redo them really quickly. It again. See if it works, and then we'll check if our track loads a game correctly. We haven't done everything yet because we haven't done the item and enemy routes, but after this, it'll be pretty good. So, it's Toad Circuit. Okay, we got it to load. So now our truck loads in game. And that will, uh, okay, yeah, there's a few errors, but still. There's still a few errors we need to fix, but it's good. Right here, loaded in game. Let me look at that really quickly. Now it loads into a glider. And it works, but I haven't applied the routes yet, so. So now we gotta fix that, and then we're gonna go into the next segment. Let's try that. No, let's not do this in Grand Prix, because it'll crash if we do that, I think. Because we haven't added everything yet, so... Okay, it worked. And it works. So there you go. That's how you do checkpoints. Okay. So I'll be continuing this tomorrow, and we'll be adding enemy routes, item routes, and the other stuff. Voila. Bye.